Montague's message, January 26, 2014. The first step towards getting somewhere is to decide that you are not going to stay where you are. Anon. Veronica and I are both happy and excited that we have managed to bring so many people together from all parts of the world to restore the divine energy of planet Earth. We are deeply grateful to all who readily responded and express a wish to come together as one big family of light and love. We have chosen the date, Sunday, February 2, 2014. We ask that you gather at sunrise or at sunset. Both, if at all possible. Gather at the sacred places or choose to meditate. Use your minds in whatever way you see fit, to bring about the release of energy. You do not even need to leave your bed, as your positive thoughts will add to the mass of energy needed. We are aware that sunrise and sunset occur at different times in different locations, but those are the most important times of the day in which to carry out this unique exercise. Veronica and one or two of her helpers will go to Glastonbury in the west of England. She is praying for clement weather. Should there be an attempt to prevent you accessing these places, never mind, just be nearby. You can use your minds, your consciousness to achieve our aims. Veronica is concerned that it has not been possible to reply to everyone. Mark will make suggestions in his message today. Every single one of you is important. Everyone can have an input. It does not cost you money, just your time. It is so wonderful to have so many countries involved, all eager to take part. We have created a huge family of like-minded people. This is a first. Let us ensure that this is a memorable event that transcends all barriers of language or creed. Together, we can bring about the changes your planet is crying out for. You are the architects of the future. This event will enter historical folklore and will be recounted over and over again for generations to come. I cannot stipulate enough the importance of this action. Be joyful as you come together. Create a massive vortex of energy all around you, with love and laughter filling the air, as you gather in peace and harmony. This is but the first of many such events. We intend these to be done at regular intervals henceforth. We will guide the way, always working together to create peace and justice, where sadly, none exists at this time. Let not age be a barrier, as you are never too old or too young to create miracles, for this is what you are endeavoring to do on this day. I ask that you now take time to read what Mark has painstakingly prepared as your introduction to the great importance of ley lines. Welcome and embrace the magician of the ley. May he be with you to guide you and encourage an interest in these most sacred sites and the ley lines that make them so. We in spirit will join you on this day of days, when you take it upon yourselves to rescue your planet, so that future generations can enjoy their lifetimes on Earth. Together, we will make this happen. Both sides of life working together as never before. To the wonderful people who willingly give of their time to enable our endeavors to be enjoyed by all, please ensure that all countries know the date and time, so that arrangements can be made to take part. Remember that together you are powerful, you are the 99%, so you cannot be stopped. You are the awakened. My dear, it will not be possible for you to write with me next Sunday, as you will be taking part in the Ley Lines Recovery Ceremony. Enjoy being with like-minded people. My love will guide you, as always. Your Adoring Monty Channeled by Veronica Keen Montaguekeen.com